Hey guys, so I'm back with another video for you and this one is going to be an exciting one because it is my 2014 or 2014 favorites. So my favorite products from the whole entire year, not just December. So we're going to get right into it. So what I'm going to start off with is nails and now this one I discovered a little bit later on in the year. It's the Sephora nail polish remover that specializes in getting glitter off your nails. Now I don't like it just to get glitter off. I like to use it um, to get all of your nail polish off because it's super easy. It basically comes in this little container here and inside there's a sponge thingy that you sort of dip your finger and you swirl it around and it takes everything off like in an instant. It is super super fast and super easy to use and there's just sort of like coarse sponge thingy that you can sort of rub the nail that has the glitter on it inside and it'll take all the glitter off it. It kind of feels like really gritty kind of like sandpaper um, so it takes everything off in an instant and you guys at home that use glittery nail polish you know what I'm talking about it takes forever to get off this stuff amazing the next thing I'm going to talk about is probably on everyone's 2014 favorites list that's the Anastasia dip brow pomade this stuff is unreal for brows you know, you'll see a lot of those Insta brows that people talk about, that they're really perfect looking and very sculpted and stuff like that. And yeah, you can do that look with this, but I really actually like it to go for a more natural soft look. I'm wearing it on my brows right now. What you can do is just use your brush to apply it. And on the other side, there should be that spoolie thingy. You can buy the um, brush that Anastasia actually sells with it. And if you comb it through, it makes it look super natural. And I just zoomed in for you guys so you can see that like you can draw that nice line over here, but when you use the spool thingy to brush it through, it actually looks really soft and natural in your brows. And the color that I use is dark brown. And it's perfect because it's waterproof, so it actually stays put really well. I mean, it doesn't smudge off easily. It is like the best invention when it comes to eyebrows. All right, and no list would be complete without the Beauty Blender sponge. Now this stuff is amazing. If you've seen my updated foundation routine video you know I use this um, sponge when I'm applying my foundation it just puts anything on super flawlessly on the skin you can use a full coverage foundation it'll shear it out and make it look really natural on the skin um, or you can even use it with a more natural foundation and it just sort of melts everything into your skin makes your skin look super flawless but it looks like you're not wearing anything at all and what could be better than that and my next favorite that I'm going to talk about is the MAC Pro Conceal and Correct Palette. It's basically their Studio Finish um, Concealers, which is a full coverage concealer um, put into this really nice sort of compact thingy. And you get six different colors with it. Mine is pretty dirty, but because I use it every day, um, it's really fantastic because you get so many different shades so you can really customize correcting under your eyes, highlighting, you can use it to brighten because it's got the yellow there, the peach is more for correcting. Um, you can use it for blemishes because it does have the um, olive skin tones and the pink undertones in the one palette as well. So it's perfect for everything and that's why I really like this palette a lot. All right, I wasn't really doing a countdown, but I kind of feel like I need to have a bit of a drum roll here because this is actually my absolute favorite item of 2014, the Anastasia Contour Kit. This stuff is unreal. Um, I don't know what we were doing before when it comes to contouring. I actually do know we were using bronzers and what were we doing for highlighting? I don't even know, but this is fantastic. If anybody's looking for a contour palette, you definitely want to invest in the Anastasia Contour Kit. Um, you get the six colors in it and I believe that she sells them individually now on her website so you can kind of um, customize, use the colors that you um, find that are more suited to your skin tone. But for me personally, the way that I use it is I use the color uh, Fawn to create more of that sort of hollow in the cheek to give a little bit more of a shadow because it does have a little bit of a gray undertone. Um, and then I use the color Havana to sort of blend it all out and make it look a little bit more bronzy and not so gray. And then I use the color Banana to brighten under the eyes. And you can tell by my makeup, it actually works pretty well. Um, the contour is nice and sharp and then it's really nice and sort of light and highlighted underneath. And I don't like shimmer highlights because I find it kind of looks a little bit more artificial. So that's why I really like this banana color to highlight. And those are my favorite items for 2014. I can't wait to try what's coming for 2015. And I want to wish you guys all a very, very happy new year. I hope you guys just dream big and work really hard for 2015. And I know we can all accomplish what we want to in 2015. I believe in all you guys. And I just want to say thank you so much for all your support with my reintroduction back into the YouTubing world in 2014. 
and I can't wait to share more videos with you guys in 2015. Thanks so much. This is the Formula X base coat and top coat. Now the base coat is really fantastic in that it fills in the ridges and really smooths out the base of your nails before you put your nail polish on and it 